Welcome to 20 fascinating facts about Eritrea, a small but culturally rich country. From its unique cuisine to its rich history, there's so much to discover about this often overlooked nation. Let's dive in. Eritrea is a country located in the Horn of Africa, bordered by Ethiopia to the south, Sudan to the west, and Djibouti to the southeast. It has a population of approximately 6 million people and its capital city is Asmara. Asmara is known for its well-preserved Italian colonial architecture, which includes Art Delco buildings and theatres. Eritrea was a colony of Italy from 1890 until 1941, when it was occupied by the British during World War II. It later became a United Nations Trust territory under Ethiopian administration in 1952. Eritrea gained independence from Ethiopia in 1993 after a long and bloody struggle that lasted for decades. Eritrea is a multilingual country with several languages spoken, including Tigrinya, Arabic, Italian and English. The country has a diverse mix of religions, including Christianity, Islam and indigenous beliefs. The Red Sea coast of Eritrea is known for its coral reefs and is a popular destination for scuba diving and snorkeling. Eritrea has a rich cultural heritage, with traditional dances, music, and crafts that reflect its diverse history and influences. Coffee is an important part of Eritrean culture and is traditionally served in a ceremony that involves roasting and grinding the beans. Eritrea has a mandatory military service that lasts for 18 months, although there have been reports of human rights abuses and forced conscription. The country has a national football team that sadly never had success in African competitions, neither in the World Cup. Eritrea is home to several wildlife reserves and national parks, including the Dalak Marine National Park and the Seminawi Bari National Park. The country has a largely agricultural economy, with crops such as sorghum, millet and vegetables grown in the highlands, and fishing and livestock farming along the coast. The Eritrean Railway, built by the Italians in the early 20th century, is known for its scenic route through the mountains and is a popular tourist attraction. Eritrea is one of the least developed countries in the world, with high levels of poverty and unemployment. The country has a rich literary tradition, with authors such as Alam Siege Tesfaye and Bereket Hat Selassi writing novels and poetry that reflect Eritrean culture and history. Eritrea is home to several ancient ruins and archaeological sites, including the city of Agilis, which was a major center of trade and commerce in the ancient world. The Eritrean flag features a wreath of olive branches surrounding a gold emblem, which represents the country's struggle for independence and its hope for a peaceful future. Thank you for joining me in this journey through 20 amazing facts about Eritrea. I hope you enjoyed learning about this beautiful country and its rich culture. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more interesting content. Until next time, bye!